This is my 125 gallon planted aquarium. As you can see, I have some massive pothos vines growing out of here. Uh, this leaf right here is probably about a foot by 10 inches, and it's the vine itself is about an inch thick. It's just spectacular. Uh, I also have this nice fig tree that is growing out of here. Uh, it actually grew so large that it kind of tipped over, and then uh, as you can see down here at the base, some of the smaller, uh, there's some smaller branches splitting off there, but um, I also have some nice uh, Anubias in here, right there. There's one. I also have another one over here. The only inhabitants of this aquarium right now are a West African lungfish and some black skirt tetras. You can see a tetra back, uh, kind of back there. Uh, they kind of, you know, can hide pretty well in this tank in the roots of the pothos and everything. There's one right there. Uh, I also have one over here. Uh, I have six of them in here, but as I said, they kind of just hide all day. And uh, as you can also tell, this tank kind of needs a little splash of color, which is why today at the fish store, I picked up a, a trio of opaline garamis. All right, so in order to get them out of this bag, you know, obviously don't really want to put the fish or the water from the fish store in there. Uh, in the aquarium, so I'm just going to take uh, the bag and just pour them, uh, pour it through this net here. That should get all of them in one scoop, and then I will transfer them to the tank. Don't get in there, bud. There are two of them. Wow, look at those colors. Beautiful blues. Here, come and take a look at this beautiful fish. Oh, look at that blue. That's going to look fantastic in that aquarium. All right, so unfortunately, uh, my phone ran out of space while I was releasing these karamis. Uh, and so uh, I didn't get the release. However, uh, I, they are in the tank now. You can see the two females back in the corner there. Uh, we also have the male somewhere in here. I just saw him uh, swimming around in here. But uh, yeah, they all look just fantastic in here uh, and they're going to do great check them out he's eating some brine shrimp look he's already so comfortable in here he found a nice little corner he found the corner with a ton of pothos in it yeah he's gonna enjoy this oh look the females are eating some brine shrimp there nice Yeah, they're already super comfortable in here. They look really good too. I actually think this one might be a male. It's a little darker. The dark ones are usually uh, males and the lighter ones are females. Anyway, that's about it all I have for today. Uh, I will do an update on these fish for sure um, because yeah, I mean they look fantastic but uh, I want to get something in here though to kind of clean it up a little bit because uh, right now I don't have too many cleaning or cleaner fish in here. Uh, I have the lungfish which is kind of a bottom dweller but he doesn't, uh, he kind of just lays there for most of the day so you know it is what it is but uh, yeah this is a really cool tank and uh, I'm very glad that I get to share it with you so thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video like it uh, and consider subscribing. See ya.